This is Breast Cancer Awareness Month. Breast cancer is the second most common cancer among women in the United States. Each year in this country, about 250,000 cases are diagnosed in women and over 2,000 cases found in men. KTBO wants to help you know the facts and importance of screening for breast cancer. Dr. Andrew Iliff, an oncologist and hematologist with Missouri Cancer Associates, says that mammograms are without a doubt the number one way to detect breast cancer in its earliest stages. Iliff says a woman should get a mammogram every year beginning at the age 40 and continue to be screened for as long as they are fit. Because of the ongoing COVID-19 pandemic, many people are delaying visiting their doctor or being screened. Dr. Iliff told KTVO it's crucial to continue with those regular exams. A lot of hospitals, especially in Northeast Missouri, deserve a, a huge amount of applause for how aggressive they've been with the protocols that they've adopted to make sure that a hospital, when you walk through that door, might be one of the safest places that you can go visit. So I think that, that concern about COVID, although it's very real and understandable, uh, I think that that getting back in and seeing your doctor, whether it's your primary care and especially getting your screening test done, shouldn't should not uh, be a barrier based on what's going on. The CDC says regular mammograms are the best tests doctors have to find breast cancer early, sometimes up to three years before it can be felt. Dr. Iliff adds that while a mammogram can be uncomfortable or be a cause of anxiety, they are necessary. And as part of Breast Cancer Awareness Month, Missouri Cancer Associates is asking survivors to share their story. We're just trying to celebrate um, all of the survivors for breast cancer and cancer in general. So what we're really recommending is patients can go to our website um, and submit a story um, about their, you know, uh, either their self or their loved ones story of surviving breast cancer or surviving cancer in general. And then we're going to be making a $5 donation towards the American Cancer Society for every one of those stories we receive. To submit your story to Missouri Cancer Associates, find the link on our website, ktbo.com.